Today on Nostalgia Hit, we look back at the cast of the 1978 comedy film National Lampoon's Animal House. We'll revisit the actors and update them as of 2023. Please remember to subscribe to the channel for your daily dose of nostalgia. Tom Hulse played Larry Kroger. In 1978, Hulse was 24 years old. He was born on December 6, 1953, and is now 69 years of age. Academy Award nominee Hulse is a stage and screen actor known for film roles such as Amadeus, Parenthood, and Murder in Mississippi. His last acting role was in the 2008 action-adventure movie Jumper. He is now a Tony Award-winning producer in theater involved in several Broadway hits. Stephen First played Kent Dorfman. In 1978, First was 23 years old. He was born on May 8, 1954. He died from complications related to diabetes on June 16, 2017. He was 63 years of age. First, who was also a producer and director, is probably best known for his roles in Delta House, St. Elsewhere, and the action-adventure series Babylon 5. His last acting role was in the 2006 TV movie Basilisk, The Serpent King, which he also directed. Martha Smith played Babs Jansen. In 1978, Smith was 24 years old. She was born on October 16, 1952, and is now 70 years of age. Smith is a former model who appeared in film and TV roles such as Charlie's Angels, Scarecrow and Mrs. King, and Loveless in Los Angeles. She became a real estate broker in the mid-90s, and her most recent acting role was in the 2018 biographical comedy drama film A Futile and Stupid Gesture. Peter Regert played Donald Skonstein. In 1978, Regert was 31 years old. He was born on April 11, 1947, and is now 76 years of age. With 90 acting credits to his name, Regert's film appearances include Local Hero, Oscar, and The Mask. He recently starred in a 2023 episode of the TV series Extrapolations, where he played Ed Vandermeer. He is also a stage actor and has appeared in numerous Broadway productions. Bruce McGill played Daniel Simpson Day. In 1978, McGill was 28 years old. He was born on July 11, 1950 and is now 72 years of age. McGill is a stage and screen actor known for roles in Delta House, My Cousin Vinny, and the TV series Rizzoli and Isles, where he starred in over 100 episodes. He recently appeared in the TV miniseries Love and Death as Judge Tom Ryan. Mark Metcalf played Douglas Niedermeyer. In 1978, Metcalf was 32 years old. He was born on March 11, 1946, and is now 77 years of age. Metcalf appeared in film and TV roles which include Hill Street Blues, One Crazy Summer, and is the master in Buffy the Vampire Slayer. His most recent role as Sheriff Roy was in the 2019 movie The Field. Mary Louise Weller played Mandy Pepperidge. In 1978, Weller was 31 years old. She was born on September 1, 1946, and is now 76 years of age. Weller is a former New York model who appeared in film and TV shows that included The Evil, Starsky and Hutch, and The Bell Jar, with her last acting role being in a 1983 episode of the crime drama TV series Quincy M.E. James Doughton played Greg Marmalart. In 1978, Doughton was 28 years old. He was born on June 27, 1950, and is now 73 years of age. Doughton is best known for his appearances in The Beach Girls, Spies Like Us, and Sorority Boys, which was his last film role in 2002. He has since stepped away from the limelight. Kevin Bacon played Chip Diller. In 1978, Bacon was 20 years old. He was born on July 8, 1958, and is now 65 years of age. Animal House was Bacon's debut film role, and from there, he has gone on to appear in multiple film and television roles, which include Footloose, Hollow Man, and the following. He has several new projects in the pipeline, one being Beverly Hills Cop 4, which is in post-production. Douglas Kenny played Stork. In 1978, Kenny was 30 years old. He was born on December 10, 1946. He died after falling from a cliff on August 27, 1980. 
He was 33 years of age. Kenny was a screenwriter, producer, and co-founder of the National Lampoon magazine. He played Doug Henkel in the 1977 romantic comedy film Between the Lines, but was best known for his writing skills with Delta House and Caddyshack amongst his credits. Chris Miller played Hardbar. In 1978, Miller was 36 years old. He was born in 1942 and is now 81 years of age. Miller is best known as a writer who co-created and wrote National Lampoon's Animal House with his writing partners Douglas Kenny and Harold Ramis. His writing credits include the films Club Paradise, Multiplicity, and Perversions of Science. Verna Bloom played Marion Wormer. In 1978, Bloom was 39 years old. She was born on August 7, 1938. She died from complications of dementia on January 9, 2019. She was 80 years of age. Bloom appeared in over 30 film and TV roles, which included High Plains Drifter, Honky Tonk Man, and The Last Temptation of Christ. Her final screen appearance was in the 2003 comedy short, Where Are They Now? A Delta Alumni Update. Sarah Holcomb played Claret de Pasto. In 1978, Holcomb was 19 years old. She was born on September 11, 1958 and is now 64 years of age. Holcomb had a short-lived career with appearances in four films, one of which included Caddyshack, which was her final on-screen role. Since then, she has lived out of the limelight. In the 2004 film Stateside, the lead character is said to be based on Sarah's life. James Widows played Robert Hoover. In 1978, Widows was 24 years old, he was born on November 15, 1953, and is now 69 years of age. Widows made appearances in Delta House, Charles in Charge, and The Goldbergs, but he is better known as a producer and director. He has directed multiple television shows, two of which include Two and a Half Men and Mom. Tim Matheson played Eric Stratton. In 1978, Matheson was 30 years old. He was born on December 31, 1947, and is now 75 years of age. Matheson has appeared in almost 200 film and TV roles, some of which include Yours Mine and Ours, Bonanza, and The West Wing. Recently, he played the role of Doc Mullins in the romantic drama TV series Virgin River. Donald Sutherland played Dave Jennings. In 1978, Sutherland was 43 years old. He was born on July 17, 1935, and is now 87 years of age. Award-winning actor Sutherland has appeared in multiple film and TV roles, some of which include Invasion of the Body Snatchers and the Hunger Games film franchise. He has upcoming projects in post-production and recently appeared in the biographical drama movie Miranda's Victim. John Vernon played Dean Vernon Wormer. In 1978, Vernon was 46 years old. He was born on February 24, 1932. He died from complications following heart surgery on February 1, 2005. He was 72 years of age. Vernon was known for his roles in films such as Dirty Harry and the outlaw Josie Wales. He provided the voice on numerous productions and video games, with his final role as the voice of Norrin Judge in the animated film Delga, which was posthumously released. Chessery Donova played Mayor Carmine de Pasto. In 1978, Donova was 52 years old. He was born on March 1, 1926. He died of a heart attack on March 19, 1992. He was 66 years of age. Donova is best known for film roles which include The Captain's Daughter, Cleopatra, and Viva Las Vegas. His final acting role was in 1992, where he played Father DeMarco in two episodes of the TV series In the Heat of the Night. Eliza Roberts played Brunella. In 1978, Roberts was 25 years old. She was born on January 23, 1953, and is now 70 years of age. Roberts is also a producer and casting director, whose TV and film appearances include Doctor Who and The Tasmanian Devil. She is married to Eric Roberts and is the sister-in-law of Julia Roberts, and she recently appeared in the TV movie It's Beginning to Look a Lot Like Murder. Lisa Bauer played Shelley Dubinsky. In 1978, Bauer's age was unavailable. 
Bauer, only appeared in two screen roles, with the other being a 1977 episode of Charlie's Angels. For the past 40 years, she has been living in New Zealand and owns a handmade, candle-making business. Dwayne Jesse played Otis Day. In 1978, Jesse was 26 years old. He was born on September 21, 1951, and is now 71 years of age. Jesse, also known as Otis Day, after purchasing the rights to the band name, Otis Day and the Knights from Universal Studios, he formed a real-life version of the band and toured for several years afterwards. His most recent appearance was a 2019 comedy short called Five Old Comedy Writers Talking Shit. Karen Allen played Katie. In 1978, Allen was 26 years old. She was born on October 5, 1951, and is now 71 years of age. Stage and screen actor Allen's film appearances include The Wanderers, Starman, and Year by the Sea. She is probably best known for her role as Marion Ravenwood, which she has recently reprised in the 2023 film Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny. John Belushi played John Blutarski. In 1978, Belushi was 29 years old. He was born on January 24, 1949. He died from a drug overdose on March 5, 1982. He was 33 years of age. Comedian, musician, and actor Belushi rose to fame on Saturday Night Live and was also known for his roles in The Blues Brothers and Continental Divide. Earl Keyes was his final role in the 1981 comedy film Neighbors. What was your favorite film or films in the National Lampoon's franchise? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching Nostalgia Hit. Please remember to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, as it really helps the channel. Why not watch another video listed on the screen now? Until next time.